Humber, FWD, Utility, one of my all-time favourite British military transports. I'd love a model of one. During the First and Second World Wars, the Humber Company made a great many military lorries inspired by its range of civilian vehicles. Many of these vehicles adopted integration transmission like the FWD 4x4. That is an original utilitarian vehicle and not really a truck. The Humber FWD 4x4 was also called the Humber Box was the only light 4x4 vehicle built by the British during the Second World War. Of course, it was backed up by the American Jeep. But the latter was not on a par with the Humber, which remained technologically more advanced than the Willis. In and in particular, offered a higher standard of finish. The Humber box was therefore produced in several models, an eight-man transport vehicle, a reconnaissance vehicle, a military ambulance and officer's command car fitted with an independent front suspension. At the time, the Humber 4x4 was designed to last, even after the war, with competition from Land Rover so damaged the Coventry-based company that it closed down in 1954 at the engine box. Unit was mounted high up enough into the chassis, thus providing the vehicle with a good ground clearance, almost 25 centimetres. The rear door opened horizontally in two sections and in particular increased the internal dimensions when the vehicle was stationary. In fact, by installing vertical struts and side panels in offices could have the benefit of an improvised camping van. This model also includes a certain number of features contained with an officer's position, card table, seats with folding backs to form a bed, curtains covering on windows, various cabin lights, open top and so on. In spite of these refinements, this was an all-terrain vehicle equipped with a six-cylinder four-litre Humber engine producing some 85 horsepower at 3,400 revs per minute. And if you've ever seen the film Ice Cold and Alex, then you'll know that John Mills drove one of these in its open top version during the early scenes of that film. <coughs> a camping van ahead of its time. On the model used for officer transport, the Humber had some very British refinements. The rear door was opened as two halves, so that a tent could be erected to enable an officer to sleep in the vehicle. Wooden panels and curtains blocked out the windows and the seats were folded away in no time at all. Quite something really. There's very, very few of these left. They're one of my all-time favourite military vehicles. One, fold-away seat. Two, lower door. Three, upper door. Four, rolled tent awning. Five, self-locking hinge. Six, roof rack. 7 vertical support strut and 8 fully sliding panels. Specifications Make Humber Model FWD 4x4 Type Heavy Utility Engine Humber 6 cylinder 4.8 litre Carburetor engine 85 horsepower at 3400 revs per minute Gearbox Manual 4 speed with powered divider Suspension Front single wheel suspension, semi elliptical spring, rear semi elliptical spring, brakes, drum brakes, brakes, drum brakes, hydraulic drive, and weight 2.5 tons.